I am Anil Kumar and here is a question on permutation and combination which will help you understand all the concepts. In how many ways can a group of five pets be chosen from eight dogs, six cats and seven bunnies if there are no restrictions? Part B is they must all be bunnies or all cats. Part C is there must be at least two dogs and part D is only bunnies are selected and they line up for a race right so this kind of they're selected in order that really means so these are the four questions for you you can pause the video answer the question then check with my solution let's begin with the very first one there are no restrictions for selecting five pets from eight dogs six cats and seven bunnies so let's add them up so what do we have here eight dogs six cats and seven bunnies total is 21 there are no restrictions we need to select five right and therefore the answer will be 21 c5 okay so that is how you could answer part one you are selecting some out of given and each group the order is not important right so that is why we used combination. So 21C5 is 20349. So we get 20349 as our answer. The second one is they must be all bunnies or all cats. So or means you need to add up all bunnies. We are selecting five out of how many bunnies? Out of seven, right? So so seven C5 plus all cats we are selecting five out of six right so six c five so that is the answer so you can use the calculator and calculate this so we have seven c five equals to plus six c five and that is 27 so you get answer as 27 now, C is, there must be at least two dogs. That is to say, out of five, at least two dogs. Now, these dogs are selected from eight dogs, correct? So, we could have, uh, from eight, we could have two dogs. So, eight C2. Now, if you select two dogs, you need to select from the rest, three, right? Six plus seven is 13 so from 13 you need to select three other pets so that is one combination the second one will be select three dogs right so we have eight c3 and in that case from 13 you need to select two right or you could select four dogs so eight c4 and from 13 the pet selected will be one or you could select all dogs right so it will be 8c5 and then you don't select any other pet right so so that is what it is so now you can use calculator find the answer right so we have 8c2 times 13 c3 and that gives you 8008 so we have let me write from here 8008 plus we have 8 c3 times 13 c2 and that is equals to 4368 plus 8 c4 8 c4 times 13 c1 that is 910 plus 8 c5 and that is 56 right times this is 1 so it gets 56 now we can add them all so 56 plus 
910 plus 4368 plus 8008 is equal to, let's write it down, 13342. So that becomes the answer for this part. Now, last is only bunnies are selected and they line up for a race. So basically, we're trying to say that order matters. So we are selecting five and we are selecting one, two, three, four, five and only bunnies. There are seven bunnies in all, right? So that means it is seven, then you could six, five, four, three. So that could be multiplied or we could write from seven is a permutation because the order matters, seven, six. P5. Either way, so you could calculate the answer, which is 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3, and that gives you 2520 as your solution, right? So you can use counting principles or you can use permutation. In this particular case, order matters, and so we have used permutation. In previous three examples, we used combination since the group which is selected. The order does not matter in that particular group. I hope with this you have understood how to use permutation and combination to solve such question. Thank you and all the best.